I sit in the Boston airport, I feel nervous about flying across the country. So many things running through my head as we fly over the mountains far below. Traveling 38,000 feet over the North Pole as the sun sets on the distant horizon line. With no time wasted, we strolled on the vast, empty streets of Beijing. We only stop and wait for a moment, take a picture, and then keep moving. As we walk through the city, the old buildings stick out, still holding their ground as the new ones spring up all around them. We keep moving through subways and buildings down streets illuminated with beautiful lights. Bikes fly past us as we continue traveling onward. Cars are zooming and weaving in and out of traffic. As I stare down a path in a lantern-filled park, I feel different, changed. I feel grateful as a small traditional Chinese family takes me in for seven wonderful days. As I begin to connect to the culture, I realize that I am in China, on the other side of the earth. I see the lights zooming by as we move fast down the crowded Chinese streets. I walk beneath a seemingly infinite number of lanterns while on the Xi'an city wall. The many strange and unique features of China overwhelm me, but in the same way, enlighten me with Chinese culture. The art of Chinese calligraphy and the smoke from the burning incense fill my head with thoughts. I wonder how long I've been here. As I stare down an endless road, I realize today is my last day in China. Sadness corrupts me, making me sad to leave, but excited to get home and share my incredible stories with my community. The fast pace of the airport makes everyone move swiftly. On the plane, we may feel still, but we're moving faster than we ever have. I feel like we're already home, but the trip's not over yet. The loud drone of the airplane relaxes me. Arrival, and only a four hour bus ride separates me from my home and my community. Returning home brings an end to my two week long movement to the other side of the world.